Hello my friends, it's me again, your favorite ditch wear. Sure hope everybody's doing okay today. I need to run up here to the vape shop. I need to take some, uh, the gentleman up at the vape shop I've kind of become friends with over the past year that I've been here. And he gave me this stuff to try. And honestly, I don't like it. It was his personal juice. Um, he said he got a big supply of it and uh, gave it to me, gave me this little one to try and just told me to give it a shot and honestly I just don't like the flavor of it so you know I went through uh, one little tank of it and I was telling him the other day when I was up there getting juice that I really didn't like the stuff and I said, well, I'll just bring it back to you. And he was like, no, you can keep it. And I said, well, what good's it going to do me just sitting in the drawer? <laughs> I said, I'll bring it back to you. He was like, all right, well, if you don't like it, you can bring it back just whenever. So I got to run up there anyway. Um, I've got my tripod with me today. We'll uh, probably stop and have some lunch that'll be the afternoon video um, this will be this morning's video <laughs> it's a beautiful day out here today I'm telling you it is a gorgeous day um, I was gonna take the bike my seat is torn in a couple of places and honestly right now the seat is is just wet I the foam in the, where it's exposed is really wet. It hasn't had a chance to dry out yet because it rained all day yesterday. And I don't really want to put a towel on the seat and use it that way. So I'm just going to drive the truck up here today. I need to drive the truck a little more anyway. I put some uh, sealer in it yesterday to see if I can seal up that rear main seal without having to tear it apart. The stuff I put in it is specifically made to seal up a rear main seal that's been dried out. So we'll see if it works. I mean, it was 10 bucks. We'll see if that works or not. So anyway, I'm gonna run up here and give him his juice back. <laughs> Maybe I'll introduce you to him. We'll see what happens. All right, he's a good kid. If he's even in, in the store today, I don't know. I didn't bother to call him and find out. Um, he has his own channel on YouTube. He's, uh, you know, just, he posts some pretty cool videos. Uh, we'll see if he's even up here today. I don't know yet. Anyway, I like the way this phone, um, the auto stabilization, you know, sitting on a solid dashboard, so any movement the truck does or any movement the dashboard does, the bouncing and the vibrating of the vehicle itself should show up in the video, and it's really not. And you can tell I bounce around quite a bit. This is a, an old truck, so it's kind of rough. And I'm sure you can hear in the background the background noise of how rough things are but it really doesn't affect the camera at all so that's awesome so I'm pretty impressed with it if nothing else it's a good action camera <laughs> anyway I'm gonna run in here real quick uh, I'll see if he wants to be introduced or not if not we'll just continue with what we're doing I'll be right okay back. well my friend Isaiah wasn't here so um, I went ahead and gave that juice back to uh, his worker there I know he'll get it back so I'm not worried about that I trust him um, and I'm trying this new this new little deal here called a mojo this has 50 milligram nicotine in it and we're gonna see if it's uh, gonna work out for me now that's what it looks like little bitty thing not very big at all but it's uh, you know it's easy to carry in the pocket and you don't get a giant puff off of it but it gives you the throat hit just like a cigarette does and it tastes like tobacco 
it doesn't it's not fruity or anything like that and I gotta be honest I took a couple of puffs off of it you get about as much out of it as you do out of a cigarette as far as blowing smoke out and just a couple of puffs I got a head rush from hell um, so yeah pretty good head rush on that I don't think I'll be using that much um, juice for this I'm spending $80 a month for juice for this so I figure at $8 a piece 10 of these if it'll last me three days I'm paying the same as I would be for juice for this The difference is I won't get near as big of a puff and I get the throat hit and I get the nicotine. Now I was nicotine free for a while, but then I caught myself smoking again. It's it's a terrible habit. I, I'm trying to figure out a way not to smoke, but apparently I still enjoy smoking or I wouldn't be craving them so bad. And, you know, that's my flaw. So, hopefully, you know, people say, well, you just have to make up your mind that you want to quit. I love the fact that I can breathe better. I love the fact that I can smell things. I can taste food better. Everything's better. It's the, it's more of the uh, addiction of the habit, I think, and the nicotine. I hate the smell of cigarettes, but it's it's more the addiction to the nicotine, I think, than anything. So if I can use a little device like this, and you take a drag just like you do a cigarette, gives me a head rush. After two drags, I've got a head rush. So I think that if I'm craving a cigarette, I'll use this. I can still use the zero nicotine in this if I want, just for puffing, just for fruity flavors and stuff. But then when I'm actually craving a cigarette, I can use this little, this little mojo. So there we have it. And I can carry this with me a lot easier than I can carry this. This I have to be careful with. You know, it's really heavy in the shirt pocket. I don't want to carry it in my back pocket. Um, leaving it on the seat of the truck. If it's in the sun too long, it can get hot and explode. You know, there's just all kinds of things with this. This just fits in my shirt pocket. I can pull it out and puff on it anytime I want. So that's it, my friends. I hope everybody has a fantastic day. Keep smiling, keep trying, and please never give up.